How's it guys? So in this video I'm going to talk to you about printing on glass. Printing on glass has a lot of advantages and um, I've been watching my, my forums and my groups and a lot of people say that you must put hairspray on and glue and all these sort of things and, and I want to show you this video that you don't have to do that especially when printing with PLA. Uh, when you're printing with other more exotic materials like ABS and PETG then yeah use other products but for standard PLA glass is the best. Um, I just want to show you an example on my glass board here. On my glass there's some chips. I don't know if you can see them on that video there. Yeah you can. There we go. Those chips are actually from PETG pulling out pieces of glass. As PETG cools it grips onto glass and it will pull chunks of glass out of your bed. So I don't recommend glass for PETG. There are some goops you can put on that will make it stick and not tear out the glass and uh, you can use those. But for standard PLA you just use a glass plate that has been washed uh, with sunlight soap or, or well in South Africa we call it sunlight soap but the dishwashing liquid that has sort of a lemon additive is the best. Uh, you give it a good wash and uh, then you print from there. So just going to give you a quick demonstration on how to wash the glass bed. So we take it down to our kitchen sink and we put a liberal amount of dishwashing liquid on. We make the glass a bit wet and then we put a bit of uh, dishwashing liquid on and we massage it in every corner of the glass with your fingers just get it uh, to be clean all over and make sure that you really work that dishwashing liquid in. Once you've worked the dishwashing liquid in then you want to just make sure that you clean it off and get all that dishwashing liquid off. So you want to get all the soap away from the, the glass. So run cold water on while you uh, wipe it and get all the soap off. You can still use your fingers because the grease will not transfer. Once you've finished rinsing it then take some paper towels. Don't use a dishcloth uh, that has oils on it from where it is being used elsewhere. Rather just use paper toweling like toilet paper or a paper towel. Use that paper towel and make sure that you dry everywhere on the top of the glass and on the bottom. When you dry, when you dry in the bottom make sure that you don't touch the top of the glass. The top of the glass must remain hand print free. Right, now we're going to do a PLA print on the bed and we'll see how well it sticks. So I'm just going to do a normal uh, calibration cube and once it's done I'll come back. Right and there we have it. Our test cube is now printed and as you can see it did not come off the glass bed at all. So it is still stuck fast and if I try and move it now you'll see that it actually is quite stuck. It does not come off the build plate uh, that easily. You can pry it off but I would like to show you something. Once it cools down to, uh, to, to the correct temperature I'll show you how easily it pops off the glass and how good the finish is on the bottom of the print. So be back shortly. Okay now that the build uh, plate is cooled off and the glass is nice and cool we can now easily remove it. So watch this. Done. Taken off. Beautifully, easily, no problems taking it off. Um, now I want to show you what the, the base of this looks like. Now if you look at that surface you can see how beautifully clean it is. It is so smooth it actually reflects the light. Right, so the main advantage of printing on glass is you get a beautiful, smooth, clean underside of your of your print. Uh, it's a it's it's beautifully smooth and clean. Um, I really enjoy printing with glass. It's the only way I do it with with um, with PLA because that it sticks properly and you get decent quality prints out at the end of the day. Your prints are always looking good and uh, it sticks just fine. I recommend you clean the glass uh, after every say 10 to 20 prints. If you've left your glass for a little while then I suggest you clean it as well because it gets dust on it and then as soon as it's got dust it loses that adhesion that you get from the from the shiny surface. So that is my suggestion that you guys print on glass directly, no glue, no hairspray, just straight on the glass. Uh, thanks guys for watching. If you like this video give us a thumbs up and uh, consider subscribing to the channel. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe to the channel. We really need the subscribers. And uh, keep watching. We're going to bring some more videos very shortly. Thanks for watching. Cheers. That's it for today. Check back soon for more videos. If you like this video give us a thumbs up. This helps us understand what you would like to see. If you want to see more of our videos, consider subscribing to our channel and press the notification icon to be notified when a new video comes out. 
post comments, let us know what you want to see. Tell us if you like this video or if there's any other subject matter that you would like to see. Please consider supporting us on Patreon. We buy everything ourselves in this channel and really want to grow this channel. God bless you guys. Love you guys and see you soon. Cheers.